the Coral Up Handicap will close day two. It's a mile and six for us. Another reasonably long distance race. Nought to 75 this time. Star of Norway, Paul Rhodes. Zero to Hero, Graham Clutterbuck. Still game, Alex Cherry. Tamadot, Masquerade, Thomas Rogers. Temper, Graham Clutterbuck. Dirty A, Nosh, David Robertson. Avalanche, Obi-Wan. Drawback, Arrow and Marley, Tehran. CDJ, Leggett. Crawler, Martin Leadham. F. Scott Fitzgerald, Paul Rhodes. Lakota, Sally, Padraig Hogan. Cullihill, Jacko. Satya, Sandra Sagram. Stick, Quid, Thomas Rogers. Rings of Kiddie, Stu Gray. Crystal Clear, Obi-Wan. And Lion Star, Alex Cherry. They're off the track in this and away they go and it's beyond me this we've had so many long distance races this week why has this one got so many runners in it i have no idea but anyway crystal clear he's in the lead f scott fitzgerald is second and then cooler hill jacko and crawler a couple caught wide on the track and one of them is rings a kiddie he's quite wide on the track Still, game is also out wide. But crystal clear is clear, and it's clear by four lengths or so. Two rings of kitty, and then temper, and then F. Scott Fitzgerald, and then crawler, and then temper. I how many of these horses in this race really are one mile six furlong horses. Chunk of them a mile and a half is really. And it's crystal clear in the lead from F. Scott Fitzgerald in second, Crawler is third, and Rings of Kitty and Temper still game. And Tamadot Masquerade and the leader is making it a true test of stamina, so we'll find out whether I'm talking about the top of my hat. I'm struggling out the back of the moment is Marley Tehran. But it's F. Scott Fitzgerald, it's crystal clear, is clear of F. Scott Fitzgerald. Then Crawler, a winner last week, is third. Then Star of Norway and Tamadot Masquerade and Temper. Still game, Rings of Kitty, Drawback Arrow. And we've got six and a half furlongs still to go. And Crystal Clear. He's only clear by about a length and a half now to F. Scott Fitzgerald in second. Then Crawler is third. Rings of Kitty is in fourth. Then Still Game and Drawback Arrow. Temper is next. Then Star of Norway. Tamadot Masquerade trying to get into it as well. But it's Crystal Clear who's still in front with five to go. Crystal Clear from F. Scott Fitzgerald who's looming up on the outside. Crawler looks to be going well. So too does Rings of Kitty. Still Game is there as well. Temper is coming into it. Drawback Arrow. Plenty of chances now. Collier Jacko is starting to make a forward move. Lions star on the outside is also going well but it's still F. Scott Fitzgerald is now the leader from Crawler and Drawback Arrow. Then Rings of Kitty, Tamadot Masquerade, still got three furlongs to go. Up the centre of the track, Lakota Sally has come through from nowhere. F. Scott Fitzgerald's kicked on for home and is in the lead from Tamadot Masquerade. Temper, Crawler, still going, then Stickwood and Rings of Kitty after that one. But it's F. Scott Fitzgerald who's well clear at the moment with a furlong and a half to go. And they're not making much ground on him at the moment. It's F. Scott Fitzgerald who's still in the lead. But now as they come down to the furlong pole, it's still Still game, who's flying out of the pack. Also coming through well is Cully Hill, Jacko and on the wide outside Avalanche. But it's still F. Scott Fitzgerald who looks like he's going to repel all Raiders. And F. Scott Fitzgerald is going to take this pretty comfortably. Another easy handicap win. F. Scott Gerald wins it. Avalanche Masquerade with second star of Norway. Still game, Cully Hill, Jacko, Crawler after that. And all the way back to Crystal Clear, a long time leader who ended up tailed off last. F. Scott Fitzgerald, an easy winner there for Paul Rhodes. Tamadot Masquerade for Thomas Rogers, second. Star of Norway, Paul Rhodes was third. Still game, Alex Cherry, fourth. And Cully Hill, Jacko for Satyam Sandra Zagram was fifth. I think that's the end of day two. And um, I'm sure we'll be back tomorrow for another go.